though. Yeah, we let's get into it. versus Mr. R. Mr. R showing a lot of potential with many characters, and Young Link being one of those right here. Young Link is a character that really gets to me, honestly. I think, like, this character has confirms on confirms from across the screen. Exceptional frame data, very little lag, and I'm just like, yo, why are people not talking about Young Link? This is a problem. Ooh, okay, yeah. Gonna make it back, no sweat, up B going very far. It was Still had a double uh, dump intact. Yeah, as I well. always I always forget that Uppy has like a hitbox on it as oh, yeah. well. So I actually put Mr. R in a really a low yeah. state there. That was a little scary, but yeah, Young Link um, having you know good recovery options. Exceptional, yeah. So yeah, really good and it, uh, really nice to see Mr. R bring him out. I thought we were gonna see his prompt, so for sure. Nice stuff. And I, I know these guys practice all the time. Definitely Sky's house, all that good stuff. So not a uh, shock to see his, his Young Link is definitely very good. Yeah. Young Link coming out to play, and he's trailing by just about 10%. Gets off the ledge here. Exact looking for the roller, the up air on the platform, nice. though. Really nice stuff, Exact's actually taking the first stock here. And again, I know we we all know, since we saw the data earlier, Inkling loves this stage. This is definitely uh, his hometown stage to do it on. But uh, um, yeah, Mr. R actually really struggling to get any uh, type of a kill confirm here. Having a hard time. Exact just kind of going away with it. Okay, there's the up smash out of shield. A nice uh, stock for Mr. R to take it there. Yeah, bringing it back down to even right here. He finds the bomb into a quick aerial. Look at that. I like how he charged that arrow, forcing out the air dodge from Exax and be able to a, a punish on the follow up as well. Yeah, and there's such a great tool to have great follow ups with, of course, as we were seeing there. Um, coming out from Mr. R. But again, kind of bringing it back to even here. Nice parry, boomerang. Gonna see that near dash Ooh, attack, okay. Nice, actually that dash attack putting Exac off stage. I thought he was gonna let a forward smash rip. All right, charges it up. Second hit, connecting, but not from across the stage. Won't take the KO just yet. Yeah, I'm definitely in a better positioning here. And actually gonna let Exac get back onto the stage for free. Kind of interesting, and Mr. R. Playing, uh, I don't know, seeming a little tilted right now. Okay, F smash, putting it Mr. R off stage. Ooh, nice, Whoa, fair. deep fair. Yeah, but luck luckily for Mr. R, Young Link, I'm telling you, has that incredible recovery, and he finds a conversion into the forward air. Dude, I, if you watch Zan, man, Zan has yeah. some of the nicest Young Link confirms in, in the business, man. It's, it's nice. nuts. The character can just do whatever he wants. Pretty nasty for sure, especially with the you know like the trip like the arrow follow-ups too. The, fa the like, fact that that works at those lower percentages is still crazy to me. But again, uh, Mr. R now sitting in the advantage state here, sitting at a high 161 percent here. Um, both players actually yeah, do back and forth. Okay, nice uh, call out on the jump there, closing out the stock with the backer. And again, guys, even even here, one to stock to one stock. Okay. It's gonna be a lot of ink. Again, 20 or so percent and practically full amount of ink on your opponent. Really, really crucial for you. You gotta start, you're gonna be Ooh, able to do more is. damage. Yeah, again, it's always so scary when we see Mr. R kind of just fishing down right below him, looking for those Nair follow-ups or extensions off of the, the arrows. He's getting so much follow-ups and it's... Yeah, I mean, it, com it confirms into so many things for sure for Young Link. I mean, it, it confirms into another arrow if you choose to do so. Yeah. Really nice. Kind of you just play a little more patiently here. Definitely uh, kind of has a little more wiggle room to play around with only at 50%. And again, there's that boomerang coming back at that angle there. Would have been really a nice position to get a up air follow up. Would have been clean. Okay, tossing out the boomerang and the mm -hmm. boomerang forcing XX to jump into the arrow. Another forward air still not going to be enough. Still alive, still holding onto the stock. XX. Definitely gonna want to clutch this out here. Ooh, such a scary situation. Looking him fish for those arrows again. Woo! Oh. Perry into the up tilt, and that does yeah. it. Mr. R taking game number one. Perry's on point, coming out for Mr. R here, kind of being his saving grace in a lot of these situations here. Kind of a. I feel like that's the first Perry we've seen. No, on no, the, on he stream was so far. No, no, not for, oh, not oh, for. Oh, okay. I just mean like in general. Like oh, okay. This this set is like the first time we've seen a Perry since we sat down. <laughs> oh, probably, yeah, no, to be honest, definitely. Mr. R is coming out to play. Also, another recognized uh, top player, yeah. um, you know, representing uh, the Europe region as well. Really getting, uh, yeah, lately, Hale I haven't seen him uh, too much in getting, like, the best results, but honestly, he's here to play and uh, still has good wins on his belt. Yeah, definitely doesn't, like, go out to events as often. 
Uh, and his results are somewhat inconsistent, but a, a really, really talented player nonetheless. Hailing from the Netherlands, this, uh, but is spending a ton of time here in SoCal. Uh, he actually has been living here for quite some time, uh, just practicing with the players in our region. Yeah, no, for sure. Mr. Are you saying? Yes. Yeah, no, yeah, living out here. Um, at Skies, he's always traveling a lot, but anyways, there's that arrow again, and following up with the Nair, beautiful stuff coming up from Mr. R, and again, the parries into oh. up B. What is happening right now? I love that conversion, the down tilt to up B, and by I love, I mean, like, I hate to get hit by it, because it is so good. Oof. All right. Know, it's, it's a nasty for sure, and a great... My God, look at them. The arrow send them up vertically in this beautiful position. No. There's some roller opportunity. Yes. That's not going to be enough. And that's how Exax is going to pull himself into the lead after being at such a big percent deficit. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, for sure. Sorry, I was like, move your mic a little oh, closer yeah. there. Yeah, no, for sure. Okay, there's that jab, too. Again, going to get the extra clean, quick percent. Ooh, nice patient uh, wait. In a shield there coming out from Exax. You know Mr. R's fishing for that up tilt at the ledge or the up Ooh, smash, yeah. Okay, all right, up smash at the ledge, taking the stock right on back. And uh, Mr. R not too far behind now, going to revert back to this projectile zoning based gameplay. He's gonna get caught up by the landing back here into the jab, rolling behind Ooh, him, getting a second okay. jab. That was so much damage. Maximal, 40, maximizing. 40, <laughs> yes, 40 plus percent damage and maximum inkage. Yeah, no, for I, what, sure. What's better than that? It doesn't it might not, not even matter, though, because Mr. R with these parries looking really spicy right now. Oh. And that's the whole point of inking your opponent. It's, uh, when you're connecting hits oh. with them, you're getting all that extra percent. Oh. But okay, following up with the fair offstage. Really nice edge guard from Exax. Yeah. Clean stuff again. There's that jab. Zero to 24 damage. They're really yeah, nice Exax, stuff. Uh, Exax playing that to a T covering every single option of recovery that Mr. Har had at his disposal. Not letting him get back to the stage. The arrow, unfortunately, gonna miss. Avoiding the down smash punish, though. Very fortunate for Mr. R. Forward smash, not enough, not from center stage. All right, and I like how we're using the splat bomb to kind of, you know, get back onto the stage safely there. It's always nice to see recovering with those options just to kind of better positioning yourself. So nice to see from Exax. Gonna have to get oh. some ink though. Oh no, he misses the up special, but the double arrow from across the screen was kind of nice, man. Would have been a beautiful conversion. Yeah, really nice stuff. And Exax actually in the lead here with two stocks. Looking a lot better for him this game. You see that nice low recovery there and holding on to the stage. Yeah. Kind of like you were saying earlier, at those Early, higher yeah. percents, you can't hold on too long because your ledge invincibility will be up a lot quicker. So and, be and careful. Young Link's F tilt, of course, hitting below the ledge, so he's gonna take that KO easily. Roller by the ledge. Nice stuff. Nice pressure at the ledge here. Again, Mr. R playing, kind of slowing down his pace a little bit here. Gonna wanna play that projectile game, rack up that damage really quick. quick. There's that Nair. Nice spot dodge as well. Okay, and that again with the Nair. Uh, just Nair and uh, his arrow just being really great tools for him to go for a nice clean yeah. follow ups as we're seeing this whole set here so far. And again, the tether. Seven percent on Mr. R right here, making up this deficit quickly, man. It's it's proving really hard for Exax to find a way in with this barrage of projectiles that's coming out from Young Link. Yeah, he's just sitting back, throwing out the boomerang, dropping, Z dropping the bombs, which is really nice. Yeah, definitely gonna add some more coverage for uh, Mr. R there. And again, actually evening it up here. That's what I'm talking about. He kind of like slowed down his pace and was just racking up that damage. Um, just because he can, you know, being his own oh. character. Nice read on that directional air dodge, though. Gonna close it out with the fair. Exax gonna even it up 1-1 one, one here, guys. Wow. Clean stuff coming out from both players. And we are gonna hop into our game three. Nice stuff. One even to it, uh, one, and we're going juicy. to Smashville. No, for sure. I like it. I like Smashville for Toon Link specifically because that center platform being so wide and it allows for Young Link to do so much, dude. He's gonna be able to convert off, uh, have platform extensions as well as just like cover the lower ground with his projectiles, forcing his opponent onto the platform, which he can easily just follow up on. Yeah, Mr. R loves his Smashville stage for sure, as most uh, Young Links do. But all right, not gonna get that down throw up air there from Exax, too low of a percentage. Opting to roll in, nice stuff. Ooh, going really deep Ooh. there for the down air there. Kind of spicy. Going for that early on. Definitely 
wants to create a Oh, okay, he gets rollered here. Opportunity. Quick back air. I love that setup with the back air off of the berry into the dash attack. Or excuse me, the down smash. Down smash, another tool at an inkling's uh, arsenal that does a lot of ink. Ooh, and then yeah, that parry again. Really nice that he's every time converting off with them. And the bomb also, he's just, Mr. R, I feel like he has so many setups that he comes to play. He's like too many options, right? He yeah. has too much stuff to decide. And honestly, sometimes he doesn't know what's better to throw it out. It be overwhelming for sure. Something about this character, you kind of have a little bit too much options. Get a little, a little <laughs> what tricky. A, what an awesome problem to have. You have everything and the neutral air, lingering hitbox, really strong to cover a two frame right there and gets a stage spike onto Exax. Yeah, no, beautifully said, Edmund, um, for sure. And again, opting for that roller definitely is recognizing he's that kill percentage 150 here. Getting the pressure with the splat bomb. I like the short hop uh, back air there. It's nice ledge guard pressure. Again, back air. Throw out the splat Ooh. bomb and get, a, get the connection, okay. Snipe him out of the sky and Exax taking absolutely no damage before answering back with a vengeance stock. All right, he is taking 10% 10, 10 here. A back air, which is gonna fade away back into the uh, corner of the stage. Oh, actually, kind of unfortunate in there and then opting for, um, I think, boomerang there, but it, was, it looked like he was facing the wrong way, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, that splat bomb so scary at the ledge, kind of like, Kind of basically limiting your get up options pretty much. You've been uh, kind of baiting you out for a jump or a roll in. So I like seeing that from Exax as well. Being thrown out. This is pressure yeah. again, utilizing that platform yes. so beautifully, exactly. Mr. R. And that's just the kind Looking of stuff good. that I was talking about. It's, it's such a good stage for, for Young Link. He can hang out on that platform and he can just uh, do a B reverse <laughs> boomerang off of the platform. Yeah, no, really. Really nice good stuff. movement option for, for Young Link on this stage. Exactly. Oh. That's awkward. Yeah. He actually okay. connects the down tilt. He doesn't go for the immediate up B because he traded with Exax. But there's another down tilt, and that will down certainly tilt take up the K that percent? That, I mean, that connects at every percent, man. Uh, I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm telling you. I mean, yeah, it probably character. does. This character's nuts. Oh, oh yo. Oh, my God. Going oh, he bet it off. Oh, he might have saved him. He it? saved him, yeah. Yep, he's back. Yes, oh, and the no, last Exax. hit of that up B actually throwing Exax for a loop. Forward air still not enough. Yeah, Mr. R wanted to go deep Ooh. before that, but Exact's gonna save him there. Oh my gosh, someone's popping out of their chair there. All right, okay. he needed him out of here. We yeah, get him out of here. Back throw is gonna do the trick. 56% on Exax here, though. All right, coming down to the nitty gritty here. 70%, not too bad of a deficit for Exax. Definitely can bring this back. Oh, with these yo. arrows, the confirms coming up from Mr. R. Not gonna Dude, be that enough. That was so sick, but it so wasn't clean. enough to take the KO. He's got Exax at the ledge, though. Boomerang oh, and another up B. That'll do dude. it. No, it's not enough. A little stale at this point. Oh my god, that was so beautiful. Double arrow with the up B follow up. Ooh. Nice stuff. If that would have killed, that would have been a beautiful oh. clip for sure. We're going to close it out with the Nair. Nice stuff from Mr. R there. Uh, man, exact saving him though, I feel like. Yeah. Oh, that was so. Absolutely. <clears throat> so upsetting. <clears throat> oh my goodness, I might need water. Oh man. Woo. Yeah, if that's okay. Thank yes. you so much. Please have some water. Water, stay hydrated, everyone. Seriously, even if you're not, you know, active, you need water in your body. Your body is made up of like 90% water. There's a reason for that. Make sure you replenish your fluids, please. But we have game number four here. Mr. Up, Mr. R. Mr. Up, Mr. Up, Mr. Up B, dude. Yo. Might as well call him that, dude. Yo, new name, Straight Mr. Up B. He might as well just be Mr. Up B. He should, honestly, change, <laughs> his, uh, change his name for sure. <laughs> All right, guys, let's get it. Game four. Hop it into it right now. Again, going back to the stage. What is it with the stage today? I am tired of seeing the stage. But oh, you man. know what? I'm not tired. You better get used to it because oh, this game is God. still pretty young, and we're going to see uh, Pokemon Stadium in a few a lot. Yeah. <laughs> For sure, no, it's been seen it all day. And okay, interesting option opting for that uh, up throw there. Kind of first time I've seen that. Again, Young Link with all the options. Huge tool set um, as we're seeing. And again, really nice on there. Out of shield there. There's a oh. double oh. arrow and two up B. That is nasty, man. Uh. The back hit of up B, it actually drags your uh. opponent into the front hit of up B. So it's it's a really good option. I'm not really sure what happened to Exax there, but he just kind of dropped to his death. And we, can we talk about, too, how um, Mr. R is kind of oh. setting up those bombs there on the platform, kind of like a snake. Yeah. Kind of, uh, you know, limiting uh, oh, the yeah. options for yeah, Exax. So that's also really nice to count out as well. Yeah, any, like any sort of platform for Young Link is going to be a 
really good tool for him to just cover his option, right, with, with that up B. There's the up B, I'm sorry, with the bombs, but the up B coming out. <laughs> I'm Mr. telling you, man, it's up B's new name. <laughs> Mr. Up B. All right, there's um, interesting. Exact's kind of backing off a little bit, respecting uh, Mr. R, maybe a little bit too much here. That's what it's coming down to in this position. I like that. Big back air, gonna read the neutral get up. Stuff. Going off stage deep, but a nice recover and low recovery from Mr. R. Definitely does not want Ooh. Exact going for anything. But you know what? Exact's actually recognizing that, hey, you're recovering low every time. I'm going to go off for this down air here and yeah. get it. And it's kind of hard. He needs to be absolutely capitalizing on that every single time. And you can see Exact starting to adapt and utilizing that knowledge. It, the uh, Young Link players, they don't really like to recover high. They, mm -hmm. they normally have to recover low. It does go very high, and it has a hitbox on it. So it's, it's definitely not the easiest thing to edge guard. But if you can get above it, line yourself up perfectly, you can definitely sneak some KOs out of that. Yeah, no, for sure. Ex uh, Mr. R resetting back to the neutral here, though, using the projectiles once again. All right, Does that the bomb. bomb. Okay. Adding a little more pressure off stage. Definitely what you have to do, especially with the character who's so projectile based here. Okay, nice uh, situational awareness from Exact there. And I actually just realized he's up a whole stock here. Excuse me, I keep on burping my Oh my bad. man, the excitement is just so much <laughs> that it's actually causing us to just have hiccups, man. It's crazy. <laughs> no. Oh, oh out of shield. Wait, there. what? Get out of that. Get out of there, man. Roller. That was strong. Yeah, it's a good move. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I was, he was at 150, but still, I just didn't expect that to have that uh, much knockback. Dude, that's like, it's still, uh, for me, 150 is like too early for a Nair to be killing like yeah, that. Yeah, <laughs> like, I'm here we are. Yeah, I don't even know if Ridley's Nair would kill at that percent. That one, it's like super fast, too. It has no lag. You do like two of them in one short hop, dude. Like, Pretty you good. see that? Pretty Actually, good. that was kind of uh, spicy from Exact too. He kind of threw out the splat bomb there, and I, I think he was baiting for a uh, neutral get-up option, and then he opted for F smash. I think he slightly mistimed that there yeah. and almost got that, so that would have been really nice stuff to take that stock and uh, to even it up here. We potentially might see a game five. Definitely Exact isn't too uh, oh. out of uh, the ring here. Okay, jabbing him out. Exact's finding his way across the stage, trying to cover this platform with the back air. Oh, okay, nothing. He absolutely <laughs> does know. nothing, just jumps away. Yeah, it's kind of slowed down again, the pace of the match here. Yeah. Both characters really respecting, or both players, excuse me, respecting each other. A little bit too much, but yeah, Exact's going in with these fares, looking for and something, see something Mr. to grab. R looking for these down tilts. The down tilt will confirm into the up B. I don't know if it's enough to get the KO right now. But he may actually, oh, straight go. up off the boomerang. And that's it. All she wrote, Mr. R takes the victory. Three to one over Exax from a deficit at that. Yeah, I feel like Exax was kind of searching for that grab there, that back throw at the end. I feel like he was uh, trying to find some type of way yeah. in um, uh, against Mr. R. But Mr. R just doing a really good job kind of like building that wall. Again, being one of those, uh, you know, zoner characters. So, again.